Hi Scorpio, it's Elle here to do your June 3rd through June 17th reading. So it's a bi-weekly reading. Uh, I've started those. I'm not going to do the weeklies because that's, that's a bit too much. Alright, so let's start off with a five card um, advice spread for you. Um, Scorpio, thank you to those who have liked, shared, comment, subscribed to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, thank you to those who've requested readings. Uh, what else? What else? Um, how to get in contact with me is below. Let's start it off. The first card is Scorpio, right where you are. This is you. This is your energy, the first card. The second card is, are you on your correct path? The third card is, whoa, the main obstacle. The fourth card is what's helping you. Okay, these two want to come out together. All right, and the fifth card is, how can progress be made? Thank you for the messages for Scorpio. Bottom of the deck, the Ace of Wands. New, passionate, creative, beginning. Um, this is drive. This is desire. It's I want. It's passion. It's what... Fulfills you on an emotional level. But more so, it's kind of lust-filled too. Yeah, let's keep going. This is you right where you are. Knight of Pentacles. Either you're wanting to offer something to someone else or you're expecting an offer, maybe, from a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. This is a slow-moving offer. So if it's you, then you, you know, you're taking your time with it. If it's someone else, they're taking their time. Are you on your correct path? The Hierophant, nice. Getting under spiritual alignment, uh, being spiritually inclined, um, learning about the esoteric, uh, hidden knowledge, uh, spirituality, religion, um, just trying to figure it out for yourself. Getting under some, some reign and regiment, some rule uh, on that spiritual journey also. Um, not with seclusion. See, the hermit is on a, a spiritual quest also, but it's more internal. It's more self-reflective. This is you wanted to indulge in the the unknown and the question questionable about life and spirituality love and religion some of you could be with the Taurus too so um it looks like you either are on your correct path you're trying to get there it, it may be this new passionate motivation drive to do whatever to learn um what is your main obstacle? Justice. Okay. For some of you, this is <clears throat> this is a marriage. You're in a marriage. You're in a long-standing commitment relationship, either uh, romantic or business. You might be trying to get out of, or at least see a way where it um, this this long-standing commitment relationship career business relationship trying to make a way to where it balances out it, you know you feel like it's something's off kilter so you're off or the situation doesn't necessarily um swing in your favor all the time or or not so much there's some justice that needs to be enacted here some of you could be going through a divorce Four. All right. The fourth card is what's helping you. The hangman. Yeah, I can see that. This is where you are. This is where you want to be. This is where you are right now. This is Pisces. You could, a Pisces could be significant. And then King of Cups comes up. Um, King of Cups is typically Scorpio or Pisces. Um it could be cancer too but typically it's Pisces or Scorpio um, yeah you you you're waiting for 
another piece of information you're waiting for enlightenment enlightenment is coming by way of you being on this this uh learning you know getting schooled going to school uh it's all coming together for you right now you're at the hangman status for some of you you're on spring break or summer break excuse me spring break um if you are in school um you're just trying to balance everything out for some of you this is divorce you're waiting for settlement you're waiting to come to an agreement uh how can progress be made two of cups nice um this is typically cancer it's just Sun and Cancer, or maybe Moon and Cancer, but uh, don't call me. Um, like I said, this is where you are, and this is where you <laughs> you want to be. Some of you are um, definitely waiting to get out of a particular situation so that you can focus more on the Two of Cups here. This could be with someone else. This could be a business partnership, also that is. Um, you know mutually beneficial it, it, if not business it could be career I'm waiting to get out of one uh, job to jump to the to the next it's going to be more fulfilling for me and see and this is the overall energy you're motivated to do this and it's happening uh, but you're being careful with it or, or surrounding uh, this energy which looks really really good uh, three major arcana in a row three really good major arcana so uh really good energy here some of you could be getting counseling speaking to a pastor uh, okay under the ace of wands we have the world and then the hermit so yeah you've done the self reflection uh, you know that the cycles ended for you here you can go no further with a certain situation you're having strength could be dealing with the Leo strength or Virgo uh, in dealing with this situation. Just, you know, really mustering up the strength to get through because it's so easy to go backwards, to stay and do nothing with the four swords. Some of you could even be separated or uh, just really trying to heal. Some of you could be ill or show someone around you is ill. Six of Wands and then the Emperor. Some of you have um, Fire Sign who likes a lot of attention, is very stern and just their way or the highway. It could be an Aries, Ace of Pentacle, Queen of Pentacle, and then the Four of Wands. Some of you are really trying to get to an Earth sign. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, and offer something really stable here. This is where you are mentally. Uh, Queen of Swords, the Chariot, the Eight of Wands, the Four of Pentacles. Mm. With this, maybe with the air sign, you're. The air sign doesn't see. They don't see it like you see it. They, it's not eye to eye. They know something's going on. Uh, they want the truth about this situation. Um, you want forward movement. You could even be moving. You you guys could be having communication about the trouble in your relationship. But somebody's still trying to hold on. The Four of Pentacles, someone's trying to hide money in a certain situation, maybe with a divorce. Six of Pentacles, that will be a payout. Capricorn is here, the devil. For some of you, Scorpio, you're dealing with a Capricorn. They have money or they help you monetarily. There's love here, but you're also bored and emotionally confused. A decision needs to be made. It might be that you might need to just emotionally check out or walk away. And or you have already moved away. 
there might be some anxiety, mental anxiety with that. But you put behind that that partnership, trying to find a have you're trying to find balance with the temperance by way of making a choice of lovers or a choice of what to do next. This Capricorn may see or maybe get a wind to the fact that um You know, maybe this situation isn't balanced monetarily. Um, might be third party too. Um, you guys keep holding on to each other. Scorpio, there's a Scorpio and a Capricorn here. You keep holding on to each other. There's love there, but not enough. Nine of Wands it says you guys have been through a lot. The relationship is not equally yoked. It's not balanced here. All right. I'm going to start doing extended reads because it's going to be a bit too much. Okay. Let's do some career finance for Scorpio. One. Thank you for the messages for career and finance for Scorpio. Career and finance messages for Scorpio. Career and finance messages for Scorpio. Career and finance messages for Scorpio. Okay. Bottom of the deck, page of pentacles. So, you know, you may feel like there's an immature offer or a premature offer. Something's still in its infancy here. Or you may feel like you're dealing with a an immature, younger earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. This is you right where you are. The Ten of Pentacles. Nice, Scorpio. Ace of Wands, again, are you on your correct path? If you're not, you're definitely motivated to get there. Um... And then uh, your main obstacle, the hangman again. We had the hangman here. No, do we have it? Maybe the same. This is a different deck too. Yeah. So some of you are partnered or in a marriage, long-standing relationship. You might be motivated to go elsewhere. What is stagnating you is maybe maybe a Piscean person, or if not. It's just that you need, for you, you need another piece of information. You need to be enlightened about this, the, the situation in its entirety for you to make an absolute decision about what you'll do. All right. Uh, what's helping you? Page of Cups. Yeah, some of you trying to get to a water sign. Another water sign, ca uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This is typically Pisces. Um, and how can progress be made? Ace of Pentacles. Nice. For some of you, it's like you want to partner with someone. You want to offer. You want to, or you want them to. Or if you're a woman, vice versa, you want them to offer you something. But somebody's. It's really immature. Six of Cups. Uh, career and finance. It's kind of like relationship too. The Ten of Pentacles is here. You're in a good place uh, monetarily. Uh, you may even be married. Uh, the Ace of Pentacles, this is how progress can be made. Uh, accept this new foundational offer from the universe. Uh, this is something that you can build upon. Uh, this is something that, you know, um, you, you can have a solid foundation with. And... Maybe with the Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. I really feel like for a lot of you, your money. Once again, we have the same card. Strength card. Five of Pentacles. Five of Wands. Four of Swords. King of Swords. Not Ten of Cups. Nine of Cups. King of Wands. Page of Wands. Um, for a lot of you, your money is tied to you already being in a committed relationship. For some of you... You're trying to figure out what it looks like to divorce. What it looks like to divorce monetarily. Like, 
how much money will I have left over or for if it's vice versa some of you are wondering how much money you'll get in a divorce or will you be able to support yourself or will you be supported some of your hopes and wishes are coming true in regards to fire sign some of you may be separated from the air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius Capricorn Virgo Taurus is still very new but very solid also career and finance I mean I would say it looks good let me get you some advice cards also the ace of pentacles could be to start the business you know if you're thinking about starting a, a, a new business or business idea business venture ace of pentacles how can progress be made go ahead and start it thank you for additional advice for scorpio there's for scorpio four cards so, all right parental care for relationship dynamics welcome the new leaving a set of forgiveness um okay so i think this pretty much covers if you know if everything in the reading didn't resonate with you then something here resonates parental care for some of you this is um you having to go backwards you know um worry about mommy worry about dad something's going on with them they like with the four swords twice someone could be healing someone could have just had a surgery um a procedure and you you might need to enact some parental care you need to show a little bit more care than usual um because someone needs to help uh for some of you if you have children yes um they might be self-sufficient in the sense of they might be a little older but still uh you gotta go back and baby them too sometimes and you know be a parent even though they probably don't want you to let's just be honest relationship dynamics someone has entered exited the relationship or some form of the relationship has morphed transformed to where the dynamics of the relationship are no longer the same um really sit with your feelings and sit with the fact that the relationship has changed the relationship dynamics have changed do not try to sweep it under the rug do not try to um deny it also the relationship may have changed for the better it may be time for you to make that next step to move forward with a certain person welcome the new we have the ace of pentacle we have the ace of wands uh twice uh, there is newness here whatever fulfills you on that passionate level you you also had a the ace of pentacles what could can fulfill you on a passionate level can also be what fulfills you on a monetary level too um, build upon these new starts welcome the new for some of you it was outright pretty much there leaving you know you are leaving leaving is a process I don't think people really stop and think about that you know let's examine the third party relationship all right so there's three people uh the married person and then the person outside of the marriage the one of the married people who is dealing with the person outside of the marriage says okay you know what i am leaving him or her great you know if that's the decision you've made then that's you know that's all yours but leaving is a process especially when you have established a life with someone else you have things intertwined you have just life period intertwined and now you have to unravel and untangle yourself in a sense from the life that you've already had established so leaving is a process i don't know who that's for i've never even like gone into that but for some people someone out there needed to hear that leaving is a process sorry my lawn guys here making a whole bunch of noise um yeah so leaving is a process you know and 
you might have to sit down and you know really um, tell someone that or you might have to uh, really wrap your mind around that that process if you are choosing to leave uh, for some of you you need to ask for forgiveness or you need to grant forgiveness forgiveness doesn't say I uh, will erase what you've done or what you said or whatever but it does say that uh, I will release the burden of carrying around the unforgiveness okay all right so if this resonated with you scorpio take advantage of the 20 dollar three question readings uh three clear questions be very clear about what you want to know please do not be generic because then you'll get generic messages be clear about what you want to know if you want to know where are my keys we'll try to process that together okay <laughs> but be very clear about what you want to know um okay so three questions twenty dollars send an email the website will be up shortly i've just been so busy with life so i'm so i apologize and when i did have it up it was overwhelming people were able to go and book by themselves i was forgetting bookings i was this i was that and um Honey, you know, I'm quick to give you money back. Uh, I ain't got time for the headache. Nope, I don't. Um, so, anyhow, remember, Scorpio, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. I will see you guys or talk to you guys in the mid-monthlies. Take care.